Viking in Love by Doug Senko. Stig was like most Vikings. He loved fresh air, hearty stews, and of course, adorable kittens. But unlike most Vikings, there was something Stig did not like. The sea. It was not like he was scared of it or anything. Okay, maybe just a little bit. One day, as Stig was taking the kittens for a walk, he saw the most fearless viking he'd ever seen. And she said the sweetest thing he'd ever heard. Hey, I'm Ingrid. He tried to respond, but before he could, the sea swept her away. That night, he couldn't sleep. He had to get his feelings into words. So he wrote all kinds of super mushy stuff and even added a little heart where he wrote her name like this, Ingrid. Stig returned to the beach with a note. He waited and waited and waited, but there was no sign of her. Just when he was about to give up hope, he saw her, but she was too far away. He folded the note into a shape of a ship and let it sail but the waves returned to him. He folded into the shape of a bird and let it soar, but the wind returned it to him. Stig could only think of one way to get the note to Ingrid, and as much as he didn't want to do it, he tied the note to a kitten, but that didn't go so well either. As he was apologizing, Stig saw one final way that he could get the note to Ingrid. He was determined. The sea tried to knock him back, but Stig pushed on. He thought that he would be okay as long as he held on tight. But the sea wouldn't let him. Stig was finally able to hand Ingrid the note, but the sea had ruined it. He was crushed. Stig felt like the note looked. That was until he heard, hey, I'm Ingrid. This time the sea couldn't stop him. Hey, I'm Stig. I wrote this for you. Ingrid's note was the sweetest thing that Stig had ever read. She even added little hearts like this. Stig and Ingrid were like most Vikings. They loved fresh air, hearty stew, and adorable kittens. And together, they conquered the seas.